Hey guys, today I'm going to quickly go over the new combined menu options in Cricut Design Space, which you can find in the bottom of the layers panel. In order to activate the menu though, you need to select two or more layers on your canvas. I'm using the oval floral monogram, which is part of Sofonsi's Spring Crafters Bundle, and you can visit the link below for that limited time bundle deal. First option is good old weld. This merges the layers together permanently unless you use the undo button, which is the little arrow up in the top left of your canvas, or command Z or control Z. But once you leave the project, you cannot undo this action. That's where the new Unite option comes in really handy. So what you do is you select your layers, then click on Combine, and then click Unite. Unite still creates a merged shape, but as you can see from the Layers panel, there are now two layers under that group called Unite. You can edit the shapes individually if you click on them. So here I clicked on the Floral Monogram. When I move that layer, upwards and then I release it, you can see that it has now welded the shape in the place where it was moved. You can undo the Unite or merge the layers even after you save your project and return to it. Which Subtract is the next combine option and that works by removing the top layer from the bottom layer. So you just select both layers, click Subtract, and the subtracted area remains. I really like this feature better than Slice because all of those extra pieces that Slice would leave behind and those layers are automatically removed. You can also, again, edit the layers individually by selecting them and moving them around. Here I move the top layer down a bit, and then I release the layer and it automatically adjusted it. Now the next option in the combine menu is intersect and that takes the two layers and leaves only the parts where they were intersecting. If you need to edit the remaining portions, you would just select the layer and adjust it again, like you did with the other options. And then the last option in the combine menu is called exclude, which is the opposite of intersect. So when you use this option, the remaining parts will be left where the two layers did not overlap each other. Here you can see what is left where those two layers did not intersect. And again, you can undo this action